Hey, welcome. It's Brian, and this is Guitar Solo Reactions. Today we have Prince and the Revolution. We are doing the official video, and I believe this is the second time only I've taken an actual Prince video and done a reaction to it. Uh, and we are doing the song When Doves Cry. Uh, I could not find a live version of this with the guitar. And what drew me to Prince probably the first time ever is hearing the intro of this song. I actually love the song, but it's the guitar playing that pulled me in. And when this video was on MTV as a kid, I'd always, you know, I, I'd hear that. And it's basically a pretty distorted guitar with an octaver. So really kind of a unique guitar tone and some incredible playing. And then the song itself is pretty amazing in itself. So I, tried forever to kind of find a live version that had any guitar in it and they were both basically him doing it as a ballad on piano or you know him just singing it so uh, that's why we're doing the official video and here we go when doves cry So what makes that so ear catching to me is he's got a great guitar tone, but you also hear him shaking the strings like in most, you know, recordings, they don't want any artifacts of like, you know, like kind of noise, extraneous noise. And then the drum machine kind of kicks in. I'm not sure he's probably using the Lin 900 or whatever it was. I can't remember exactly which one, but, um, just such a cool way to start out and it always like i said pulled me in and then the voice kind of harmonized so amazing how many layers of vocals are on this and so much kind of um you know it's that got that really repetitive basic drum beat and then he's kind of running it through like some kind of harmonizer and you know it just has a really cool texture it's almost like a phasing effect or something and you know uh, i totally forgot this was part of purple rain the actual record and the movie so they're obviously cutting up parts of the movie putting it in here and um i think it's uh, purple rain has like two songs that i love purple rain and this one and the others i i probably wouldn't listen to um to be honest but uh, this one always just thought it was like such a cool like studio creation and like how we use the the studio as an instrument is how i always saw this song because um, he isn't just presenting a, an amazing song like him and a guitar and a drummer and bass player. He's got lo lots of cool effects going on 
And uh, like at the beginning, taking the voice is probably his voice and harmonizing it and making it go like an octave higher or something. So it's got this kind of otherworldly kind of sound. So. Maybe I'm just too demanding. Maybe I'm just like my father. dated video obviously it's from like what 1982 i can't remember exactly when the record came out but um always fun to watch and i still stand by it being as one of my favorite prince songs you know that probably kind of changes around depending on what videos i do and what i've watched recently and all of that if you were to ask me like three years ago what some of my favorite prince's songs were they would be basically from this time period of when I listened to Prince and it would be this record, Love Sexy and um, uh, Sign of the Times. <clears throat> if you were to ask me uh, three years ago what were some of my favorite Prince songs, this would be one of them. And probably a f quite a few off of Sign of the Times, maybe one off Love Sexy, the Batman soundtrack, and uh, it's not till I started doing this channel and doing all these songs that those songs were not necessarily replaced, but I opened up myself to amazing other compositions throughout his entire career that I'd never heard. So this still stands up to me. The video, not so much, but I mean, that's the same thing with the movie. It's a pretty dated um, uh, piece of, you know, film. But it also documents a certain very particular time in Prince's life and what a huge, you know, I don't, I don't even know when they did the movie if they thought it was going to be that big because um, it was huge. And, you know, I'm sure a lot of fans still love it. Uh, I personally don't. But um, it was, I just remember it so much. And... Um, I didn't like the movie. I didn't even go see the movie. I didn't even see the movie probably till uh, I started doing this this channel where I started reacting to Prince. I'd seen the Sign of the Times movie uh, because that's more of like a performance thing, and I've seen that, and I might have seen some other stuff here and there. But and I, I have saw parts of Purple Rain, um, but I never saw the whole movie. So anyway, uh, I am Brian. I love Prince, man, and. Uh, I'm really sad I couldn't find a live version of this. I wish he would have. If you know of one that has guitar in it, that'd be great. Because once that guitar intro is over, there's no guitar in the entire rest. It's basically keyboards, singing, and drums or a drum machine. So um, that's why I thought I'll just do the official video and it has that cool intro and then goes into one of his best songs ever. So I am Brian. I'll see you later.